hearty good morning to all from a stepping stone course book turn page number 87 in our page number 87 we have lesson 12 the one that got away the one that got away is authorized by jan mark jan mark was a british writer of children's books she had written over 50 novels and plays and many short stories before originating the story let us talk about the characters this story has three characters first is malcolm who is a class four child second is mrs cooper who is his teacher and third malcolm's classmates who don't want to be left behind The setting of the story is in Malcolm's classroom. In this story, Mrs. Cooper asks all the children in her class four to bring something interesting to the class the next day so that they can stand up and talk about it to the class. Malcolm goes home and looks at his shelf where he keeps his interesting things. but cannot find anything to suit the occasion the next day when it is malcolm's turn he goes up front with a match box opens it upside down and begins to jump and then gets on all fours looking for something when he is asked what he is looking for he says that what has dropped out of the match box has six legs sharp knees and frilly ginger eyebrows mrs cooper and all the children are terrified and start jumping and kicking malcolm keeps pointing out to different places saying it is there but misses catching it each time actually it was his imagination no bug was there in his match box now let's step into the story welcome back to the lesson the one that got away mrs cooper was a very encouraging and kind teacher beside teaching her lessons she used to encourage the students for extra co curriculum activities so she told the students to bring something interesting to class the next day so that they could stand up and talk about it to the class mrs cooper had told malcolm to bring something interesting because last time he had brought a simple stone and she had taken it as an interesting thing so malcolm went home and looked at his shelf where he kept his interesting things but could not find anything to suit the occasion the following day all the others had gerbils rare shells fossils and other things to show but malcolm had nothing he went up to the front and held out a match box he then opened it upside down and jumped mrs cooper jumped too and when asked to malcolm he said that what had dropped out had six legs sharp knees and frilly ginger eyebrows on stocks everybody panicked and it was charles as they spotted it and tried to hit it and jumped out of its way malcolm barks in the knowledge that his contribution was definitely the most interesting that morning although he himself had not seen it thank you